5.1 number six, um, continuing with the idea of simplifying some of these expressions. And what we'll notice is that we have two of the reciprocal identities. So a lot of times what we'll do is we'll get those back in terms of sines and cosines. So what I have is a seven and secant would be one over cosine of theta and secant would be one over sine of theta. And it's important that we keep theta there because when we go to type it in, we're gonna to have to grab that from the symbols menu in WebAssign. And if I do this, I have seven, one over cosine of theta times. Now remember, when you divide by a fraction, you multiply by the reciprocal. And so now I have seven, times sine over cosine and if you go to that sheet again that has all the information in it sine over cosine is simply tangent so you'd want to type in 7 tangent of theta and it's important that you get that theta from the symbols menu in um, like when you click in the box It'll be in one of the tabs off to the side, I think, in symbols.